Hello everyone! I was just catching up on the Housewives of Orange County's audio vlogs that Eric records on yourrealityrecaps.com. Love it. Don't have to read, can just listen. And <laughs> thanks everyone for tuning in. I'm Comedy Jonah and welcome to my weekly vlog of Housewives of Orange County. Lots to talk about. We skipped a week with them last week, but Vicky, 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 let's start with the queen of Orange County. Crazy as usual, but I'm telling you, I love the snoring. The snoring and falling asleep every time Heather talks is hilarious. I'm starting to do it at work myself. I love it. Thank you, Vicky. Um, Tamara, not a whole lot to report, except she looks fabulous in white jeans, as we saw this week on the bull. Glad her arm isn't broken or anything. It did seem to speed up a little bit. Hmm. I don't know who you're pissing off, Tamara, but you better stop it. Um, of course, Lizzie. I'm loving Lizzie. Beautiful, outspoken, smart. I love her. You know, I'm sure we're going to get a lot more into her because we see what the season's going to bring, so it's going to be pretty crazy. I'm a little done with Chairgate overall, so we kind of went through Bookgate with New York, and now we're going through Chairgate with Orange County, and I'm just about done. Let's find something else. Um, I'm also really glad we're not seeing Brianna's husband this season. It doesn't look like it. I don't know. You know, I understand what Brianna means about Brooke, some of the things he said, some of the, some of the stuff he said on recording. But you know what? I think like mother, like daughter, because Brianna's husband is a little scary to me, too. Maybe those two ladies should just go their own ways and live together with all the babies. I don't know. Um, talking about my favorite girl, Shannon, keeping it real, a lover, really upset and disappointed seeing her kind of get emotional and cry a little bit. You know, geez, I mean, okay, you're a little late. Uh, it's awful. Yeah, maybe she should have let you know a little bit, but I think there's a way to do it. You know, when you talk about manners in class, and Heather, I think you were just a little bit of a pit bull, okay, at the table. I think it's one thing, you know, you talk about maybe she should have taken you aside. Maybe you should have taken her aside, too. Heather Dubrow, I've always liked. She has her own way either. She's kind of like black licorice, just like Bethany Frankel says. You either like it or you hate it. I like it, but at the end of the day, you know, I'm starting to agree with Tamara and Vicky. I want to see Heather let her hair down a little bit. This, this kind of attitude and not really loosening up is kind of getting a little old. And I think she's getting a bad edit this season, but overall I think she's great. I think her little cameos on these sitcoms are great. Um, but yeah, it's, it's starting to get a little much. Loosen up. Do drink the shot, Heather. All right, guys, that is my quick recap. Don't forget to read Zach's blogs on Orange County on yourrealityrecaps.com. They are funny. The pictures are hilarious. I am going to get more consistent with these because my schedule's lightening up. Yay for me! And we're preparing for Big Brother 16. If you Housewife fans or also BB fans and have not purchased your live feed yet, you can do it on yourrealityrecaps.com. Um, we get a small portion of it. Every little bit helps. It allows us to bring this type of content to you. Until next week, love you. Bye. Mwah, 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 mwah.